Hello friends, this video on sound part 3 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Now, many of you uh, might get confused. You might be thinking that this type of periodic uh, to and fro motion is called oscillatory motion. It is also called oscillation. But now we are saying that it is vibratory motion or vibration. So how is oscillation different from vibration? Well, they are not very much different from each other. Basically, they are the same thing. It is just that vibration happens very fast. So you can say a fast oscillation is often called as vibration. So there is no significant difference between oscillations and vibrations. Both are basically the same thing. Just that when frequency is small, we call it oscillation. Okay, now what is frequency? That might be the next question coming up on in your mind. So we will talk about all these parameters a little later. So I'll park it for now. When we discuss about frequency, I'll come back to oscillation and vibration. Okay, so now let us take the example to understand this. Now, when we say that the frequency is small, that means it is not moving very fast. That means the, the way it is moving from one extreme to other extreme, that is relatively smaller. That means the speed is small. So, that case it is called oscillation and the best example that you can think of is the pendulum of your clock. Do you think that it moves very fast? It doesn't move very fast. It moves considerably slower. So, that is an example of oscillation. But when the same motion happens in a very fast way, that means it keeps moving. So, oscillation is like this. So, it will move like this. But in case of vibration, it will be like it is moving very fast, like this, like this, like this. So that is vibration. So example of vibration could be the guitar string. So when you look at the string of the guitar, you can actually see it vibrating, but it will be very fast. You can just, uh, I mean, you cannot see how exactly it is going from end to end, but all you can feel is it is moving. It is in motion and it is in very fast motion. So whenever the frequency is very high, whenever the movement is very fast, there we use the term vibration there. And when the frequency is small, that means it is a slow motion, that is a oscillation. So that is the only difference between oscillation and vibration. Now when we talk about sound, we mostly talk about vibration because here we are talking about the fast motion. So here you look at this example. This is, I'm sorry, this is a very good example to tell you how fast vibration could be. You saw here how quickly it was moving to and fro. So that is an example of vibration. So now the question is, is oscillatory motion periodic? Of course it is because as I said, oscillatory and vibratory, they are the same thing. They are periodic motion. So Every oscillatory motion is periodic. That means for every oscillatory motion, it will happen in equal intervals of time. But that doesn't mean that every periodic motion need to be oscillatory. Now, what is what do we mean by periodic motion? A motion where equal distances are covered in equal intervals of time. Now, let me give you an example of periodic motion, which is not oscillatory. Let us suppose... Now let me give you an example where the motion is periodic but it is not oscillatory. So one such example is the rotation of the earth around the sun. So if you look at this motion, what kind of motion is it? Is it periodic? Yes, of course, because the time taken to complete one rotation is always fixed. So every equal interval of time it is covering the same distance. So obviously this is a periodic motion. But do you think it is oscillatory motion? So anywhere do you see a to and fro motion? It is not a to and fro motion. So this motion is periodic, but it is not oscillatory. So not every periodic motion has to be oscillatory. But yes, all oscillatory motion, they are periodic because every oscillatory motion is going to be a to and fro motion and it is also going to be periodic. It will happen periodically. So every oscillatory motion is periodic in nature. Thank you. Please visit www.examfear.com to watch more educational videos with a better experience. Please do not forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for latest updates. Thank you once again.